Vermont Legal Aid gives free legal help to people in Vermont. You can call us or look at our website to learn about many legal problems. Today we will talk about housing discrimination and how to ask us for help. We have five offices. This is our Burlington office. We are by the food shelf in the Old North End at 264 North Winooski Avenue. The picture on the left is the Montpelier office at 56 College Street. The picture on the right is the St. Johnsbury office at 177 Western Avenue. The picture on the left is the Rutland office at 57 North Main Street in Suite 2. The picture on the right is the Springfield office at 56 Main Street in Suite 301. Another way to get help is our website. Here you can learn about lots of different legal problems. You can also ask us for help. You can also watch videos about legal problems. If you call us for help, tell us what language you speak. We will give you an interpreter. We will ask you about the problem, what the problem is, who it is with, and their name and phone number. We will also ask your name, where you live, who lives with you, and how much money you make. Let's talk about housing discrimination. In the United States, there are laws that protect you from discrimination because of certain things about you. It is illegal to discriminate in housing because of your race or the color of your skin. It is illegal to discriminate in housing because of the country where you or your parents or ancestors are from. It is illegal to discriminate in housing because of your religion. It is illegal to discriminate in housing because you have children. It is illegal to discriminate in housing because you have a disability. It is illegal to discriminate in housing because of your sex, sexual orientation, or gender. It is illegal to discriminate in housing because you get money or other help from the government. Discrimination in housing can look like a landlord refusing to rent to you, having different rules for you and someone else, or a landlord or neighbor bothering you where you live. Here are some examples. It is housing discrimination when a landlord says that you can't live there because of your religion. It is housing discrimination when a landlord says kids cannot play somewhere but adults can be there. It is housing discrimination when a neighbor says bad things about the country where you are from. If this happened to you or you have a question, call us or come into one of our offices. We will give you an interpreter for free. Our phone number is 1-800-889-2047. Again, that's 1-800-889-2047. The work that provided the basis for this publication was supported by funding under a grant with the U.S. Department of Housing and Urban Development. The substance and findings of the work are dedicated to the public. The author and publisher are solely responsible for the accuracy of the statements and interpretations contained in this publication. Such interpretations do not necessarily reflect the views of the federal government.